Alright, so this is Kadomon Hyper Auto Battler. This was used to. This game used to be Super Auto Battlemon, something like that. I don't know why they changed the name, but they did it. Uh, it was awesome. The, the previous game was awesome. I have seen like so many changes, so I wanted to give it a try, and this is going to be again part of the it's part of the Steam Next Quest. Alright, uh, I don't remember a lot, so let's go for tutorial. This game was a lot of fun. Is it loading? I don't know, don't ask me if it's loading. Welcome to the world of Kadomon. I'm Professor Nock. But people just call me Professor. It's a research shop. I'll be here to guide you throughout your adventures. This world is filled with mysterious creatures called Kadomon. Kadomon are all around us, having fun adventures of their own. They like to travel with those who prove themselves strong. So if you want to meet every Kadomon, you'll have to be ready to fight. To help with my research, I've collected three rare Kadomon. Believe! It's a grass-type Kadomon. It's not super strong on its own, but it's really good at supporting its allies at the start of the battle. Monku is a fire Kadomon. It's an aggressive battle, being able to quickly counter an opponent's attack. Chris is a water type Kadomon. This Kadomon is strong and defensively able to protect both itself and its allies. You can choose one to travel and battle along you. You can track what types of Kadomon you have in your team currently using this helpful mirror. If you have two or more Kadomon of the same type, you'll unlock special abilities called synergies. Alright, on heart. Uh, I'm going one. What is that? Deal 50% to all enemies. What is that? When? I like hit one dot. Um, this, has, this one has 18 HP and 9 attack. Let's go fire. In your adventures, you'll travel all over the world across areas we call regions. No two regions are alike, and each of them is filled with new Kadamon to discover. At the start of an adventure, you'll see the list of available Kadamon in that region to the left. It may look empty at first, but the more you encounter new Kadamon, the more this list will fill out. By hovering over a new area, you can see what types of Kadamon you could encounter here. Yes. Bring your adventure left click an area at the bottom of the map. Uh. I don't know why is this in Spanish and the other part in English. I'm confused. But this one is like bug earth, earth uh, grass, grass physical, lightning thingy. Let's get this one. Begin your adventures. Damn it. Congratulations, you have started your first battle. In battle, you'll come up against teams of wild color one. Win and you'll get rewards, an opportunity to have a wild Kadomon join your own adventures. Lose and your team will lose morale. When your team's morale is hit zero, your adventure will end. To help you out, I've lent you one of my assistants, Nock. Nock are not powerful fighters, but they are very helpful in a pinch. In balance, the order of your team is very important. Some Kadomon are better suited to be at front of the queue so they can protect their allies, others might have abilities that require them to be further back so they can support from the rear. To rearrange the order of your queue, you can pick up and drag your units using left click. Right click on Kakadamon to open their card and expand the view. Try it now. Every Kakadamon is different with unique stats and abilities to help you in battle. At the top of their card, you'll find their core stat, HP, attack, and speed. Oh, you know, there was speed also. On the top right, you'll find their typing. Uh, Kakadamon can have up to three types at the same time. Kadamon will do bonus damage against opponents if their tap is strong against their opponent's type. Alright, to check what types are strong against, there is a helpful chart you can access in the top right. Every Kadamon has a unique passive ability. These abilities can be triggered in many different ways to help turn the tide of battle. Make sure to read their description to check how to activate that Kadamon's passive ability. That's what I wanted to know. Some Kadamon also have keywords home in which grant them additional abilities. Not every Kadamon has this though, so keep an eye out. The mine doesn't. <laughs> the attack is in yellow is the Kadamon super attack. This powerful attack will trigger once Kadamon has built up enough charge during a battle. Don't worry about those for now though, we'll show you them in action shortly. To get back to the action, press the close button. Okay. I want to inspect. To start the battle, hold down the play button. 
The bar has begun, I'm rooting for you. At the bottom you'll be able to track battle status. The top bar is that Kata must help once they hit zero they'll faint and exit the battle. This bar at the bottom is your speed bar, this will feel automatically when it's full that Katamon will perform a normal attack dealing damage based on its attack stat. Most Katamon will attack the front, most Katamon in their opening queue, but they are some with special abilities allowing them to hit opponents further in the back. The middle bar is your charge, will be filled bit by bit when your Katamon performs normal attacks. Once it's full, that Katamon will unleash their powerful super attack. You can control the speed of battles with the battles at the top, good luck. So, I want to see my guy. Alright. You won, congratulations. After a battle, all your Kadamon gain experience points. Once they accumulate enough experience points, something exciting will happen. Here, you can see the, a breakdown of how well each Kadamon performed in the battle. You can see how much damage they did, how much health they lost, and how much they recovered or shielded. After every battle you'll gain rewards, you'll always gain two gold berries. This can be exchanged in the shop for new Kadamon or experience points. You'll always get to add one wild Kadamon to your team. There is endless combination, so be sure to try out new allies all the time. Winning will cause at the will cause the two counters at the top to count down by one. When this hits zero, you'll gain bonus rewards. When the left counter hits zero, you'll get a bonus item. Items can be equipped. To Kadamon to land the bonuses in battle. Items come in two types, single use and hold. The former are consumed when used, the later are not. <laughs> to equip an item, open the back screen using this button. When the right counter hits zero, you have a bonus field effect. Field effects grant permanent bonuses that will apply throughout your adventures. Name your rewards by left clicking on them one by one. Get them on. On heal, deal two damage to front enemy. Uh, Alright. An item. On attack, apply two poison to a random enemy. On any gain frail, gain one fast. On ally spawn, gain five energy. Field effect. On ally a head heart against two strength. Welcome back on the screen, you'll be able to set up your team for the next battle. You can view and rearrange your current team members here. If your active party is full, then new Kadamon will be stored in the box. You can easily swap units between your party and box by dragging their icons between the two. If your box is getting full, but you no longer require a unit, you can release them back into the wild. This will mean they'll no longer fight with you, but they'll impart their wisdom on the rest of the team. Your items are restored here. Drag them onto Kadamon to use them. Kadamon can only hold one item at a time, though. You can replace the item or Kadamon is holding by swapping it for another. To equip the item, you just got to one of your Kadamon. Also, on this screen, you can access the Sparka Shop. Shoka is quite a greedy guzzler, so he'll happily let you play with his friends. If you can keep bringing him delicious gold berries. You can view your current gold berry total in the top left. You can buy new Kadamon to add to your party or purchase additional experience points from Kadamon you already have. Nothing catches your eye, you can redeem tokens here to restock the shop entirely. You can collect these tokens by adventuring and overcoming tough adventures. Okay. So, speed time it takes for you to attack. Lower is faster, okay. This guy is Earth the Fire. Let's continue. Those are the basics, I hope that'll help. I'll chime in from time to time if there is anything else I can assist with. If you would luck on your adventures, there is plenty to discover in the world of Kadamon. Forge strong partnerships with your Kadamon and make new friends along the way. Oh, oh that was a long 10 minute tutorial. Come across an event where you choose your action. You found your first random event, damn it, but the world is filled with these fun encounters and you'll get to interact with Kadamon's in new ways. 
Be sure you read each event carefully before you make a decision. Some events have relatively minor effects while others can have major ramifications on your adventure. To continue, drag one of the event cards into the slot above. You see a... Uh, you see a yellow blur swiftly buzzing about the distance. So closer inspection, a long beating in, is training in the woods. You spot a beating hive. A beating hive a short distance away from the beating. The physical type. What is physical? On Ali Heart, apply to the front enemy. Uh, how do I do this? Physical type. There. Apply. So we have two physicals on Ali Heart. Apply that. Okay. I'm not really sure what happened there. Come on, attack once more. Oh, I'm dealing shit damage. But they are dead. Well, what, where, where did you come from? Don't die! Yep. Alright, uh, rewards. Got one. On heat gain, that this one is water and earth. This one is ice and lightning. On faint summon shelter ally. Okay. With ally gain the shield, grant them two of energy. On ally super, grant the front ally two four. Right. Let's take this one. Not really sure, but let's take him. Give me the vault. I get to the shop every single time. Okay. Continue. So, battle a special unit, receive one of that. Now, this time to the left. Uh, you come here front. Oh, I remember this guy was strong. Wait, one of my guys just died. Why is my guy attacking though? Is this hitting? There, finally attacked. Holy shit. Come on, attack once. Attack once for fuck's sake. Oh my god. Oh my god, they are so fucking slow. What the actual fuck? The critical one. On find someone at level one. I like this guy. Oh, I got absolutely destroyed there though. On hard gain, well, you got destroyed, there is no point there. On poison apply the end two of that, so what are my options? Ooh. On a star apply two that to all the enemies that don't get removed. On heart apply five to a random enemy. Ooh. Oh, he already had one! I just realized he already had one. Uh, you come here then.
Oh, what is that? Onala in front. I haven't checked the types. Can I see the types? Because my guy. There. So, yeah, I want to see physical. Like fire, he's strong against grass, ice, and bark. Physical. What is strong against physical? Toxic, air, and dusk. Actual? Is this guy killing my, my other guy? Oh, he shelter an ally. Oh. Yeah, I don't like it. I want to replace him. Speed up, speed up. Come on, come on, you can do it. Alright. The big one is dead. This is taking a long time, let's speed it up. Oh, I'm barely, barely winning here. I won. Oof. Uh, two gold. An item. Or a star, Tigger's ally. Tigger ally in front, super twice. On starting in 5, consume while half shield, reduce damage taken. Ooh, I like the first one and the last one. On the light super grand, the front ally. Let's see this one. Give me a card one. I kinda want the bonus XP, but this guy is, looks insane. On ally in front. Attack deal one to allies behind. When I kinda want to give more XP, yeah, I want to get more XP for my other guy. Not a big fan of this one though. Ah oh, man. Ah, oh, let's restock. Kinda wanna keep the the types. Oh, this one, Mushiki. I like those types. Okay, let's try to get them. You come down here. Mushi, you come here. Can I get rid of his item? Items on start, trigger, ally in front. What? If I release, do I get the item back? And Bavari is evolved. Woo! View. On heart, apply five to a random enemy you consume. This one should go with the one guy that has a lot of HP, which is none of them. Let's go like this. Edit and upgrade your team. I don't know if I really want those tickets. Kinda want to edit and upgrade my team. You found your first rest area. Came back to the brother. Uh, at rest areas, you can take a moment to make any adjustments to your party that are needed. You can also choose one of the above rewards to take with you on your journey. You can grant one Kadamon a bonus of 330 XP points. Or you can add an initial type. Okay, when you're ready, make your decision. XP. You are dying way too fast, so I, I, I want you to evolve. There we go. 
Look, thank you, my new, my new guy. So, with 27 HP, you're still fast, though. I wonder if I should keep the on attack apply to... Or the other one is better. Maybe I think the other one is better. I, should, I will take the other one. Next time, though. I cannot do it here. At least I don't think I can. Alright. Yeah, this is a winning formation. Get fucked. Give me the gold. Select a field effect. An ally move an ally to shield. An ally faint. Ally hit five of that. An ally faint. Yeah, okay, uh, five of this. An ally move an ally. No, let's, let's see this. Recruit a Kadamon. Bonux XP. On heart, apply 5 to a random enemy, and this one on attack, apply 2. Well, let's go on heart, and you on attack. There we go. So, next fight. Ooh, the second guy looks pretty cool. I should have items. Oh, one guy got wrecked here. But all of them got also wrecked. The main guy just dying. Select an item. On attack apply one freeze. On ally attack again. Okay, give me another one of this. I don't know if, if I can get something by skipping. Okay, now I have to decide. Ooh, on ally send deal one to a random enemy. I kinda... On attack someone wants to... This is kind of shit, though. Yeah, let's get this guy. Oh, no, but this one is also fight. On, on ally hard, apply that to the front enemy. It will be uh, getting rid of one of those. I will take this one. Uh... I will go like this, and I will see how it goes. Alright. Uh, next fight. Oh, I'm close to the boss. Oh, who is this guy, though? Alright. I don't know who they were, but they got destroyed. Rewards! Got one? Um, I want to keep the synergy, so let's just make him evolve. Woohoo! He, he has been dying so much. Looks pretty bad. <laughs> you card. On heal, deal for. When am I healing though? I don't think I have a way to heal at all. But this might be a waste. Let me see what else can I get. Uh, lowest max enemy must attack this unit. This will be physical. This is physical um, plant. This one is physical and fire. What will, what will fire be? Let's start all allies in extra strength. Lowest max HP enemy must attack this unit. Why? I, I don't like that. Ah, uh, let's continue. Ooh, middle or right? Middle or right? Let's go middle. I remember this cat was insane. Oh my guy here has 46 shield. Holy shit. 
All right. Field effects. Turn all lightning types into toxic types. Ooh. Ooh, front array takes two less damage. Do I have to equip those though? No, I think those are for yeah yeah yeah. Select an item. These are equipped on faint gain one which stays between battles. Too too late for that. This is a new a new demo version that was released today. It's like the official prologue in like hyper ultra battle uh, I forgot the name. Prologue. That's the prologue part idea. That's the only thing I remember. Alright, so oh this guy was great. I don't remember why, but the god the cat was great. On faint summon a level one Urbir, apply poison to all enemies, gain three blah 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 and blah blah blah. I feel like just leveling up my guy. So can I make them evolve before the last fight? Release. Doesn't look like that will happen. I have eight money. Anyways, uh should I cannot restock. I have eight gold. I can take one. And maybe recycle him to make my other units level up. If I continue. Oh I can upgrade my team. Unit gets earth type, that's great. That's fucking great. Can I see how much HP do they have remaining there? Because I want this guy to level up. Let's try it. Fuck it, let's try it. Apply. Oh, you didn't level up. Oh, no. No, I mean, they didn't. No, evolve. Evolve. Is there a way to not go to the boss and, and buy? Do I have a shop? <laughs> Give me a shop! Here. So there is no way it's going to level up, but... Let's just hire a random... A random you. And recycle him. There, one level up, one evolve at least. Ooh, but only one. Okay, that's the best I could do. Now, boss. I remember though, in the other demo, I mean, they also explained it here. I have like a potions that I could play. And this boss was not in the other one. Okay, he's summoning stuff. My main guy already died because that's what he was been doing the whole time. Was he dead? There you go. GG. <laughs> GG. Yeah, that guy is just too strong. Uh, I feel bad by using him, but I found him again. See, I just like it. I tankiness and poison just works great. Thank you for playing the Cadamon Prologue. The full game will contain a lot more Cadamon for you to discover along with new bosses, events, items, effects, and new features. To stay up to date on the game, which list the full game below. Alright. I just I just wanted to give it a new try because I, I just really like it the previous time. I think I tried different builds, I think I tried uh, every type when I played. I just wanted to see how much it had changed. I still like it. I'm, I'm also glad. I don't know if they removed it that there were like uh, active items that you could use in the middle of the battle. I think they mentioned them in the tutorial. But I remember in the previous game they were too OP. I could just beat the boss using all my items. I didn't like that. Also I don't like that my... <laughs> my default Kadomon was just dying over and over and over and over and over. It was sad. Poor guy. Anyways, that was a uh, Kadomon Hyper Auto Battles. Prologue.